Corey Edmond, head strength and conditioning coach. Well, it was probably my um, familiarity with uh, Mark and um, the whole Stoops family. Um, I told him on the, on the funnier side that um, I was going to write a book about all the brothers. And uh, I was blessed to have the opportunity to um, be with Bob Stoops at Oklahoma and um, being able to turn that program around and actually messing up college football by winning the national championship in two years. Um, had the opportunity to um, go with Mike at um, the University of Arizona and being able to turn that program around and, and, and move into the right direction and um, look forward to the opportunity to do the same thing here with Mark. Five. Perfect reps. Train the right way. Well, everywhere I've been with not only um, Coach Stu, so it was Mark, uh, with Mike and his brother Bob, uh, they prided themselves on that type. Hard-nosed defenses and um, offenses that were um, almost impossible to stop. And I think with that combination, um, you give yourself an opportunity to win. I'm pretty sure that if you go back and look at it, the, the Mark Stu's run defense were top of the nation and Neil Brown with his offense top of the nation. I think that's a a recipe for success when you come into a program you know exactly what you want to do from that perspective that puts you way ahead of the curve. You're always excited. I think every day you wake up to, to be able to do a job like this is a sense of excitement. Um, the main thing is that um, you look forward to the future success and, and allow these players to experience that success. I think that's excitement in everything. We all know what um, what we have to deal with as far as building a program. And I think it's more than just, uh, from our perspective, building from a physical standpoint, but you know, um, an emotional standpoint, psychological standpoint, and also um, you know, having a city to embrace what we're trying to do. I think it should be an excitement for everybody. What they have done thus far, as far as recruiting, the name of this game, I don't care what, which way you look at it, is recruiting. We have to be able to go out there and get good players, and good players want to play with good players. And not only getting those good players, but having the ability to be able to develop those players from every aspect. The personal attachment that we have with guys. My, my lifelong goal is to help um, boys turn to men and be able to foster with those parents, you know, and, and allow the parents to see a better man leaving this place and then when they got here. And I think that when you can have those long lasting relationships, I mean, that's why you do what you do. The only thing we can do is, is um, basically, is take and approach our jobs one day at a time. And that's what we're gonna do.